Hello, hello everyone. It's me, Chaff Commander Coffee, and we're here with episode 3 of my Humankind Let's Play. Where we left off, we'd uh, flipped into the Celts, who we were doing pretty good. I reminded myself that we've actually flipped into the Celts, we now have uh, our agrarian ability, so we can do that. An Akkad's in a prime spot to steal population from, well, pretty much everyone around us, so let's do that. 200 influence. I'm going to steal a little bit of pop from um, Thebes, but that's okay. Let's do that. Mm, I don't make enough food to support this many people. So uh, can we get that Nemerton built? We can. Alright, let's just let's, uh, whip that out. That's okay. And now it's getting 30 food, so it will grow a lot faster. Okay. Uh, let's see, where's my armies? Well, I've got some riders who are going to pop out so that we can get trade expeditions and explore these little islands over here and maybe pick those up. Uh, we've got, let's take a look at diplomacy. We've got the Mayans. Have we got any crises against you? Mm, they don't like us. Okay. Am I trading with you? I'm not trading with you. You guys are vassals to the, uh, to the Mongols. Now, you want me to give you a CAD. I'm going to ignore that. Am I trading with them? I am trading with them. I'm going to refuse. They might... Mm, they're the Mongols. Mm. They're not going to dow me, then I'll leave them alone. We have the Umiads on our borders as well. Uh, let's just keep trading with these guys, I think, instead. I've only got 8 gold this turn, so maybe in a few turns we'll do that. So we've got our armies over here. Um, the mines are our next goal, but for now we're going to just uh, remain a little peaceful. We can expand onto these areas without actually uh, fighting them. I will take Swift on our units. Yeah, sure. That's going to help with uh, exploring these new islands. We can come down here, actually. There's a new alliance got formed. So we can't do that just yet, but we'll soon be able to move on to those islands. Let's move you there. Two turns for that tech. Are you demanding? Oh, give a cad? No. Okay, they doubt us. Alright, alright. I see you, Mayans. I see you. There's actually some neutrals here that I should probably go get rid of. Uh, I could pop out one of these cav. And they're actually attacking us because I only had the cav on the field. Um... Oh, they are bringing in reinforcements, okay. Alright, well, I've got troops here. I guess I'd get my troops healed up, but... Cost me a bit of gold, but it's not too bad. These swordsmen are getting beaten pretty hard. Oh, uh, okay, we're gonna lose those swordsmen, that's fine. We'll have to start building more troops. He's only got warriors, he doesn't have a uh, swordsman of his own, so... We should be okay. Let's get some more archers up on that hillside. Get some gay sartai down onto the ridge there. Mm, it's going to be difficult to maneuver the uh, cav around. Let's move them over here for now. And we need to retake our flag, so you can take an attack there. You guys can attack there. You can get a kill. You guys can do quite a lot of damage, actually. Let's see how the mines move from here. Okay, I need to pull these guys back. Let's uh, pull these guys back to the Danu. You guys can swing at them. You guys can kill them. Alright. Next turn. Not too much damage from their end. Okay. That's fine. Get a shot in there. Get the cavalry to flank, and we can take a very nice attack with the uh, Gay Sartai, and they're dead. 
Uh, I never know how to pronounce that, so I'm going to keep pronouncing it as I am. Uh, we've got a military star, cool. We're going to have to build some more troops. Uh, let's get a couple more uh, swords. Thebes, uh, let's train another raider. And we'll get... Oh, Cal doesn't have any population. Oh, we can build them right up at the front there. Okay, let's get another archer and then another raider. Uh, let's kill these uh, independents. We can do some more trading with the uh, with our allies. Let's go buy some more dyes. Not too expensive, and that's going to boost our uh, boost our economy. Can we get a customs union? No, they refuse. Okay, uh, I'm going to renounce that, renounce that, and oppressing my people. I'll renounce that as well. That's fine. Try to keep good relations with them. Uh, we'll get a little fight in with these. Uh... That's how I should have spawned the archers first, but that's okay. Might actually attack the archers from there, but we'll see. Okay, no, they're gonna attack the raiders. Alright, the archers made short work of them. So we're gonna have a bit of a stalemate war on the borders of the mines. I don't actually need to go and attack one of their cities, I can just hold off here and uh, we'll be fine. Let's get another archer. Uh, you guys are going to get on some boats next turn. So are you. Okay, just wait. Still want to be building up our realm, so as long as we don't lose too many troops in this... Uh... You can protect your interests far from home. And maybe redefine what those interests are. Okay, I see some warriors here. Okay, we forced a retreat, good. I can actually take the attack there as well. They do have some reinforcements, but we should be able to kill these units fast enough that they won't be able to join the fight. Uh, so if we move you over there... Uh, let's have our archers just pepper these guys. They shouldn't last very long. There we go. Easy peasy. So we're draining the war support of the mines pretty fast there. Especially if the fights keep going in that sort of... Uh, they keep going that well for us. Uh, Thebes... Build a raider there, that's fine. Army wages, don't want to worry about that. Independent peoples, we're going to take the assimilate. Because that moves us closer to uh, homeland, and homeland uh, allows us to get some extra combat strength. Right, let's get you onto this island. Let's get you guys to grab that and then have a little sail down here. Probably get you onto this island. I should really take an attack against them, but I could just wait until we get a little bit more healing. So we'll just wait till we get some more healing. That's fine. 
get some more trade with you guys. That would be cool. Let's buy the horses. Let's buy the copper. Oh, we haven't got potters here. Let's get the potters workshop. Uh, I want both of those. You can skip a turn. You guys can just chill there. Uh, let's get another swordsman, and then we'll go back to building things. Yeah, I don't know what the mines think they're doing, but they're bringing more troops in, that's what they're doing. Uh, I can take this attack. Alright, force them to retreat. I could ride in here and force those guys to retreat as well, but we won't, we'll just wait. There's no need to be overly aggressive here. We have the advantageous position. You know, why attack our opponent where they're strong when we can just uh, There's our Aesthete Star. Okay, we should be able to age up to the uh, Medieval soon. But we can get more tech, we can get our Builder Star, we can get probably another Agrarian. We can definitely get our Militarist and our Expansion Stars. For sure. Oh, okay, no, they're retreating that fight as well. Okay, keep forcing them to retreat from our borders and uh, if they can't get a concerted force to fight us, then that'll be good. Three influence or faith and new grievance? Well, our faith's pretty strong. I'm not sure if it's going to get powerful enough to really push grievances, and I do like extra influence, so let's go with uh, extra influence. Until they start worshipping delivery services and bank accounts. Let's work on the fire temple, and then... Oh, you've got a Nemetan you can build. Oh yeah, I was going to build it down there. Okay, work on that first. You're working on that. Mm, get your Nemetan finished. like to get all those finished for the next era. And more faith is always nice. Let's pull those guys back. Okay, well, they've moved up. And they're going to retreat that as well. Okay. More fool you. Don't come near my borders and I won't have to, uh... Oh, there's another island over there. Okay, let's go take a look at that island. Have these guys have a little wander around. Oh, this is Lake Baikal, yeah. I forgot we had Lake Baikal here. Okay, very nice. Uh, cats or ferrets? Oh, we'll go cats so we can go closer to the center, get a little bit more stability. Percentage of science is not as worth it at this stage of the game. Alright, they've gathered up quite a lot of troops. We can force them to retreat there. Alright, they're fleeing further into our territory. I don't know if I, uh, I support that. Okay, the Mongols are very angry at us, which is not great. Hey, we can pick off this uh, four stack that's uh, really deep into our territory. We can pick them off, and then um, see what we'll do next. Oh, a curiosity, nice. Right, I think the best spot for this outpost is here. Depends what's in that tile, but it's probably there. Uh, let's go check out that. I think that's a three. Yeah, that's a three spot island. There's normally a three spot island in these little coastal island areas. And they're better. Got a new civic. Army wages would move us closer to homeland, and I like this buff. So. They had best provide a reliable income. Okay, so we're going to try and catch out these uh, four dudes over here. Okay, let's kill these four. Oh dear, they're going to have a really bad day. Right. Let's put our cavalry out on this flank with some swordsmen. Let's keep our archers up on this high ground. Some 
have out there. Very cool, okay, and I've got more swordsmen I can deploy in a moment. Right, where can we take shots? You've got shots against these warriors. We'll try kill off these warriors actually. I think my archers are going to do a pretty fine job of that. Alright, those warriors are dead. That gives me free access into the middle of their army. move some of the raiders up. Got a nice uh, flank attack on those archers, so we'll finish those off. You guys got high ground, so you can attack them. Right, we can finish those off with the archers. And you guys are outside of range, so we'll move you down here and take a shot. And then you guys can run onto the... Uh, flag and uh, take another attack. Oh, there's a warriors. Okay. Well, we killed all the javaners before they even got a chance to attack at range, so very easy fight. More XP for our army. I think we got a militarist star as well. Yeah, we did. Very nice. Okay. So yeah, we're going to get uh, quite a few gold stars in this era as well. Uh, I'd love to get my expansion star, which we should do once we grab these provinces or we end the war. I might age up before we end the war. Um... We'll see. That's a good spot, yeah. Let's get these guys onto the boats and then onto this area here. So we attach uh, Lake Baikal to Assur, and then we'll attach this area to Memphis, I think. Akkad's very small. Uh, I'm not really sure what I'm going to do with it yet. It's a good spot for a maker's quarter next to those mountains. Uh, I want to get a garrison there. I think that's an important place to stick one. Alright, and we can get some more trade as well. Okay. Uh, obsidian, let's buy that. Gemstones, let's buy that. Might have to buy that iron as well. Yeah, let's buy some of that iron just ahead of schedule. Adding more trade routes is always useful uh, for income. Okay. Everything else is ticking along nicely. The Nematons are coming along. We've got a new Civic. Uh, I don't really care about the Slave Civic. Uh, Mines are having a rough time. Yeah, they've got 20 war support. It's not dropping, despite them being the aggressors here. Alright, they're attacking us, probably because they have reinforcements. Uh, it's not going to go very well for them. Pull the horses back. I'll leave one one cab there. We'll leave, actually, we'll keep them bordering so they get extra combat strength from friendly units being adjacent. But yeah, they have to attack up this little ridge line, which is really is that, that is a terrible position to be in. I cannot say I envy them for that. I would not want to be in that spot. Right, so you've got an Assyrian raider. They can come around here. We've got a gay Sartai as well. He can go around there. Uh, we've got a couple of archers. Let's get them out of uh, range of uh, combat. Move you guys... Like there. And you guys stay in the garrison. Okay. You can take some very nice shots here on them. Alright, how about you guys? Alright, you can take a shot there. You can take a shot there, it's not guaranteed to kill, so shoot there. You guys can get a killing shot. Get you guys to take the low ground. Get a swing in at the uh, Javelineers. Okay, the Assyrian Raiders are a little bit outdated now, so I'm going to have to try and get them upgraded into a, a more relevant unit soon. Um, let's try to flank those guys around. Let's get these guys flanking around. End round. So yeah, I think a lot of this episode is going to be me fighting the Mayans. Um, these battles do take a little bit of time, so... Okay. 
Well, easy shots. These two can finish off that warrior. Uh, you can run in there. Finish them off. Finish them off. Yeah. Can't think. Yeah, Proximity State is attacker from declaring war. But yeah, their, their recent losses are not um, not favoring them at all, really. Right, let's get you into the water. You guys are just uh, continuing on to that island. Oh, there's a curiosity there as well. Very nice. Okay, can end turn. Uh, can I use my agrarian ability again? We can. Uh, our card can't really support that much pop, but we're going to do it anyway because, hey, we've got our agrarian star too. Very nice. Um, what I can do is get them to work on something like a forge. Buy the animal barns out. Okay, they're not starving anymore. We're being attacked again. Really? Now you guys are ballsy. Well, you're about to have a really bad time, I think. Because uh, my swordsmen are ready to mess you up. Move a cab down there. Let's move some archers up onto the high ground. Okay, that'll do. Two warriors, two Japanese again. Shoot down at those guys. Get some attacks in. You guys can finish them off. You guys move over there. You go support. There we go. Easy. Mine's just throwing their armies away. But I mean, they've got, that is like, I would never want to attack that, uh, this position here. Like, this is basically the only way they can get into my land besides going all the way. I mean, even this is cliffside, so. Yeah, they'd have to go here, so they've got to go around and then up. And then I can just defend the city, which gives me all this high ground, so. Uh, fighting the Mayans, they basically can't, they can't fight an offensive war against us. But that's what they're trying to do, and, uh, it's not going very well. Right, let's go protect our uh, territory there. Move you onto that island. Get another outpost set up. Alright, let's get a Sur to attach. Okay, I can do that next turn. Conquest has been researched. Got our Ura stars. Go explore this end of the island first. I think that's probably enough. Oh, there's the Great Blue Hull. Ah, okay. So I don't want to attach two natural wonders to the same city, because I don't think they stack. But, you know, actually, you know what? We can test, because I haven't tested since Victor opened dev. And that's worth doing, so let's test that. All right, let's build some uh, Maker's Quarters out this way. Uh, let's finish the Temple of Artemis first. It's only going to take two turns. And you guys... Ooh, there's another island. Okay, well, I guess you can keep exploring in that direction. I was going to get them in the water and then uh, just to get the rest of the vision over here and then bring them back. But since there's another island we can reach, let's let's go take a look, yeah? Let's go reach that. Let's reach out. Anyway, getting that uh, natural wonder, very nice. Get an extra plus 10 stability and a bit of cash coming in as well. It's also a pretty good tile, so yeah, lots of industry out there. Thebes uh, can help with the Temple of Artemis, which means you... Can we still two-turn that? No, now it's three turns. Okay. Which means Thebes can work on something else. Um, could start working on some market quarters. That's a very nice market quarter. 
down here is pretty good for market quarters because the tiles are not very good. So let's go set up a bunch of market quarters so we have a little bit more, uh, bit more money coming in because we're going to need to start filling up our merchant stars. Uh, not, not for this era specifically. I mean, we're probably going to be um, aging up after this war with Maya. Okay, let's keep exploring. Get you guys into the water. Memphis can attach that for 500. We've got a new civic. Industrial production, really, already. Well, I like the extra farmer's quarters would be really useful because we have the Celts, so. Alright, and they're retreating that battle, which means they're going to lose all their war support next turn and we can just force surrender. And take what we want. Uh, I don't feel sorry for them. They shouldn't have uh, doubted me. Alright, let's go build... Um, I think I want to build the outposts here, because I can go makers, makers, and get all that extra forest, which is quite nice. Okay, let's go. It's time to age up um, into the medieval. I'm going to try and get one age up per episode if I can. Congratulations on building but we still want to get like it is a, site of a decent fame, right? Even more so if you also worship okay. Give me your outpost. Thank you very much. And a thousand gold. Thank you, thank you. Go and attach that. Get out of my land. I can even attack these four dudes who are just sitting there, because uh, they're in my land, and uh, I am allowed to do that. I can even attack this army as well, so uh, yeah. Sure, let's do it. Get out my land. Get out my land. Oh, these guys were retreating. Oh, okay, so we get to mop up four of their units as well. Very cool. Must admit, I'm a big fan of that. Not the best position, I must admit, sitting on this uh, low ground. Uh, you guys can go there to provide a flank. You guys can run up there. You guys can go over there. You guys can stop reinforcements. Okay, let's try kill these guys off with the archers. You guys can kill them. That's probably not the best attack we could be making, but um, that's okay. The, the raiders are kind of very outdated at this point. They can't fight classical era units. Um, they're good for bullying scouts, that's kind of like what the Assyrians are, are best at, bullying scouts. And uh, burning people's outposts down. The bigger the map, the better they are, really. But that was a good fight. Um, they want to trade luxes. Uh, refuse. I want to trade luxes. You haven't got any luxes worth buying. Uh, speaking of, can I trade with you anymore? You haven't got anything else to sell. Okay, that's fine. Uh, we've got another event. Lucky, cool. Uh, very lucky. Go attach uh, Hemun. And you guys can get over to whatever this area is. Let's build animal barns, a forge, stone cutters, a barracks. Uh, public fountain, I'm not so bothered by, but I'll get the extra influence though, that's nice. A sir, same deal. You've got a lot of infrastructure you need to build. Barracks. Fountain you don't really need. Theater's good. Thebes, same deal. Yep, same deal. Got to start working on infrastructure. It might be worth us flipping to an industrial sieve to do that. Um, but then again, we're making lots of money, so maybe we could just flip to a mercantile sieve. I would like to build some market districts over here. Can we get an Ameton set up before I age up? 
Yeah, okay, so if I spend a turn building this or even just buy it out. Okay, yeah, now we can age up. Let's do that before we end the end the episode. Cool, so we got plenty of gold stars in this era. We didn't quite get our agrarian. Can I maybe steel pop? Six turns, okay. Uh, it, it, we've got plenty of fame. Yeah, we've got plenty of fame. Let's age up. So we've got a few options. Uh, we could go Aztecs. <laughs> even more movement speed. Dude, our units would be so fast. <laughs> Uh, not ideal though, I don't think we want to go Aztecs. Uh, Byzantines, no, it's not as more allies. I could go Franks. We could go Franks. I don't know. Ghanaians, not so much trade, it's a smaller map. We could go Teutons. And we could try spread the faith a bit more. We already picked an expansion so if We could try go for the achievement that lets me get for playing one of each culture. We could go Norse and try get to the New World, but I think we might be able to pop to the New World anyway. Let's go Franks. Let's take these guys. These are aesthete. Yeah, sure. Why not? Let's go with Franks. They got nerfed a lot since uh, Victor Open Dev, but thank God they were a bit they were a bit powerful. Okay, let's end the turn and then we'll. Uh, We'll uh, jump into the medieval. Good to be on it. King of the Franks. Sounds like something you'd eat at a baseball game. Baseball games? Oh, there's a wonder we can claim too. Okay, Toad IG or Notre Dame? Notre Dame might be quite nice. I don't really care about Toad IG, but... Sure, let's go claim Notre Dame. Why not? Let's do it. Not my favourite wonder, but... It is a wonder, and we can build it. Create outpost cost? Sure, let's replace. Why not? Uh, let's build Notre Dame. We can build it over here somewhere. It's not great tiles for us to get a bunch of yields from taking Notre Dame, but... Uh, I guess I could put it, like, here, get some industry. Yeah, sure, let's just put it there, that's fine. How long would that take to build if I get everybody on on the uh, job? Nine turns. All right, we won't we won't have anyone build it for now, and we'll just try sort out our uh, our infrastructure for a bit. All right, you guys are going to set up an outpost there. Like next turn, you guys have found a new world. Very cool. You guys can chill there. You guys can chill there. All right, we're in the medieval era. I can culture bomb uh, if we want. Uh, how much uh, how much influence is that going to give me? Culture bombing one of these. Let's culture bomb a cad. Thirty influence. I mean, it's not that it's not that much, but it's, I guess it's better than nothing. Right. Okay, guys. That'll be it for today's episode. Or well, I say today's. There's actually going to be a couple. <laughs> but uh, yeah, that'll do for today. Um, Thank you all for watching. I hope you enjoyed. As always, leave your comments in. Uh, the, well, the comments, and I'll uh, I'll get back to you when I can. Uh, otherwise, I'm streaming on Twitch as per usual. So if you want to check out some live humankind content, that's the place to do it. There'll be a link in the description. Yeah, hope you had a good one, guys. It's been me, Chaff Commander Coffee. Take it easy. I'll see you around. Goodbye for now.